In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add a glow to a light bulb and animate the flickering like this. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, here on the left, I have the bulb image. I'm just going to go ahead and drag it and create a new comp. Now let's go down here. Let's right click, create a new solid. And I already have the color chosen, but if you have a different image, you can select the uh, dropper right here and select kind of like yellow like that. And just click OK. Now let's go here to the top and select the ellipse tool. I'm just hold shift and I'm just drag it kind of like that. And I'm gonna select the uh, selection tool here. Place it on top kind of like that. Let's go down here to the mask and let's change the feather to 200. And let's go ahead and make a copy. I'm going to disable this one for now. And let's go ahead and change the blending mode for this one. Let's change this to uh, overlay. You see the before, after. And this one, let's enable that. Let's change this to screen. And let's lower the opacity on this. If you hit T for the shortcut, it should bring up the opacity. Let's bring it down to about 20. Let's try 30. I think 30 is good. That's before, after. Now select both of the uh, glow and just go to layer, pre compose. And I'm just naming that glow. Make sure that's checked. Click OK. And let's go down here to the toggle and switch. And if you select this, it should have the blending mode back on. And all you have to do is hit T for the opacity, hold Alt, select this, and all you have to type in is wiggle. And the first number is going to be how many times it's going to flicker in a second. So let's try 10, comma, and the second number is going to be the opacity. So I'm going to do 90, and let's see how that looks. And if you want to change it, make it more intense, let's try 50, see how that looks. Maybe it might be too much. Yeah, it might be too much unless you like it like that. Change this back to 10. And let's try 50. All right, I think I like that. 10 and 50. 